coronation robes suit you very well. Of course they do. I was born to wear them. I always knew this day would come. I always knew that the crown would eventually be mine. And I've been there with you through it all. Have you? Yes, I suppose you have. And soon we shall rule. We? I never cease to be amazed by your capacity to delude yourself, Diva. I shall rule. You will be allowed to watch, if I keep you around at all. Of course. Now she is going, I am disappointed. I should have liked the opportunity to belittle her further. I'm sure you did so expertly. Of course I did. Now I'm going to take a long bath and plan my first actions as Crown Prince. An interesting state of play. Did you just feel it? No. Must have been a breeze. Your duties involve leaning on shovels, do they? No, Diva. What do your duties involve? Shoveling. Shoveling what? Elephant dung. Sorry, uh, what was that? My duties consist of shoveling elephant dung. <laughs> yes, they do. So don't let me keep you from them. And as well as declaring a public holiday on my birthday, I'm commissioning a statue for the main square, say, two stories high. No, make it three stories. Bronze. What kind of statue? Me, of course. Something dramatic, like me slaying a dragon. That's always good. <laughs> this is fun, isn't it? Knowing we'll soon be ruling Manjapur? Knowing I'll soon be ruling Manjapur. Don't get ambitious, dear. I can bring you down just as fast as I raised you up. Remember that. A new day is dawning for Manjapur. <sighs> Surely my coronation robe will be ready by now. going on here, Diva? Where did that come from? Answer me! How did you do magic? I'm amazed it took you so long to find out. You fool. You've changed everything now. I was prepared to wait to be the power behind you. But now you've gone and spoilt it. Yes, the shard. I'm a sorceress. And I've been waiting a lot longer than you to rule Manjapur. Now it seems I'm going to have to move faster than I planned. Oh, well. No use crying over spilt magic.
A destroy spell? That's not nice. <laughs> My powers are gone. Not that I really needed them, but I took them anyway. They're mine now. Impossible. You think so? <laughs> <laughs> Whenever you are in my presence, you are lower than a flea, Vashan. I warn you, do not try to stand in my way. A new day is indeed dawning for Manjapur. It's just not the one you expected. I'm sorry to intrude. <laughs> Lord Vashan. In the dungeon. It's more appropriate to his new status. I'm taking over. You have no right! Really? I have every right. Now, where is the crown? The crown is not here. Then you will bring it to me. The crown is in a secret location. Because there is no ruler at present, it is kept hidden. Where? Only one person knows. Who? Omar. Omar? I need the creature. How do I bring an Allah back? I'm sorry. There's something you actually need from me? Don't play games with me, Vishan. I'm not your lackey anymore. I need Anala. And the person who commands Anala needs a walk and some fresh air. The stench of the dungeon does tend to permeate the clothes after a few hours. <sighs> the command. Anala, move! Give it time. Give it time. See, total subservience. Now, I'd love to be able to get an hour to do your bidding, but I can't. It's a royal thing. She'll obey only me. You think so? Oh, yes. So, you need me. Ruler of Manjapur. The golden chains of command find you, Anala. You are mine. You will take me to Omar. Now. Oh well, back to the dungeons then. <laughs> <laughs> 